graphic design is a challenging job that requires serious hardware and software, so it's no wonder you're looking for the best laptop for graphic design. In the current digital nomad and work from home haze, laptop characteristics such as mobility and weight have become extremely important. As for many professions, finding the best laptop always involves finding the right balance between performance and weight, light screen, portability, maximum features, and an affordable price. We have listed the top 5 laptops for graphic design and their key features plus the things you need to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all the products mentioned in the video are in the description below. You can also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, legitpick.com. Number 5. Dell XPS 17 Having a gorgeous large screen with a high resolution can be a great help for graphic designers, and this means that Dell XPS 17 is a laptop worth considering. It packs a fantastic 17-inch UHD Plus screen with HDR, which makes your work look its very best. That larger screen also means working on this laptop feels comfortable even for long periods of time. The Dell XPS 17 also proves that a large screen laptop doesn't have to be big and bulky. This is an impressively thin and light laptop with the same attractive design found in the smaller Dell XPS 13 and XPS 15 laptops. It also comes with powerful components as well, including 11th generation Intel Core processors up to 64GB of RAM and an NVIDIA RDX GeForce 3060 graphics card. This means that this laptop has more than enough power for even the most intensive graphic design workloads. Number 4. HP NV X360 if you're a designer that needs a laptop that not only looks but feels like a premium laptop without the premium price, you should check out the NVX360 from HP. Thanks to its compact and sturdy design and excellent performance, it's the best budget 2-in-1 laptop for creatives that you can buy. A 15-inch touchscreen is bright and brilliant, plus it also supports the MPP 2.0 pen from HP which gives you a great way to create beautiful images easily. The most exciting aspect of the NV is what's inside. AMD's Ryzen 4000 series powers the laptop which can handle multitasking with ease with AMD's integrated Radeon graphics card. You can expect to have a good gaming performance delivered as well. Number 3. Apple MacBook Air Not just the best laptop Apple has created, the MacBook Air is hands down the best laptop you can buy if you work in creative field right now. Packed with a revolutionary ARM-based M1 chip from Apple that powers it, the MacBook Air is a thin, lightweight laptop that offers great performance for graphic design. Also, it is the best laptop for editing video and other creative jobs in 4K and over 11 hours of battery life on a single charge. While many products reach the high end of most consumers' budgets, the price of MacBook Air is relative to many other options on our list. However, the ability to not only use Mac apps but also iOS apps for iPhone and iPad make this laptop a game changer. Even if you've only owned Windows laptops before, the MacBook Air from Apple is worth jumping to macOS. Number 2. Microsoft Surface Laptop 4 Apple may make excellent laptops for graphic design, but its old rival Microsoft has brought out a brilliant device with the new Surface Laptop 4, which gives the MacBooks above a run for their money. While Microsoft may be better known as a software company, it's been putting out some great laptops recently. At its most recent device is an ideal laptop for graphic designers. Not only does it have a gorgeous design that's thin and light, but it has an excellent pixel sense touchscreen that will make your work look its very best. It's also got an excellent keyboard, powerful specs, and incredible battery life. It's a fantastic showcase for Windows 10, and it's more than capable of running any graphic design app you want. Now that Windows 11 is out, it can also be upgraded for free. Number 1. MacBook Pro 16-inch It may come as no surprise that a MacBook Pro laptop is our pick for the best laptop for graphic designers. Apple MacBook Pros are hugely popular with creatives and graphic designers thanks to their excellent build quality, design, and power, and the brand new 16-inch MacBook Pro is the pinnacle of this. Replacing the Intel-powered model from 2019, the MacBook Pro 16-inch comes with a choice of Apple's powerful M1 Pro or M1 Max chips, which can handle even the most complex graphical design tasks, as well as stunning XDR mini OLED screen and a huge battery life. Apple has also increased the screen size slightly, as well as added a great selection of ports including HDMI and a memory card slot that makes it easily the best graphic design laptop out there. It's rather large, however. If you're after something more portable, check out the 14-inch model below. How to choose the best laptop for graphic design There are six major factors you must consider when choosing a laptop as a graphic designer. Operating system The operating system should be the first thing to look at. 
While traditionally, the choice came down to either macOS from Apple or Windows from Microsoft, Google Chrome's OS has become a very popular option and is usually found in laptops that are a little more budget-friendly. CPU The CPU is the brain of your laptop. If you are doing design work, a processor that is fast and powerful is key. You want it to be able to run complex software without any issues. While there are many options out there, look for a quad-core or an extreme series processor. RAM When you are working on your latest project, the number of programs you are using runs much smoother if your laptop has a good amount of RAM inside. The laptop you choose comes with a specific RAM capacity. Don't fret if you buy a laptop without a lot of RAM, you should be able to buy and install more RAM if you need it. We recommend at least 8GB RAM at minimum, but for high power tasks, 16GB is a good starting point. Storage There are two types of hard drives that you might find in a laptop, hard disk or solid state. While HDDs are cheaper and can have more capacity, they can give your laptop issues. On the flip side, SSD are lighter, faster, and are more durable. Newer laptops tend to pack in an SSD. If you find one that doesn't, you can always modify the laptop to add one. Display to do their work effectively, graphic designers need a display that not only gives them ample screen real estate, but also provides rich and vibrant colors. The last thing you'd want is for that bright green to look dull. For most designers, a 15-inch laptop is suitable, although bigger can be better if you have space and the muscles to carry it around. Looking to buy a laptop with a touchscreen? There is no universal approach among designers when it comes to touchscreens. Some love them as they provide a quick and easy way to zoom in and out. Others hate touchscreens since they don't add much to the experience, but in time you will get used to the touchscreen. Battery life Most graphic designers love novelty as it brings inspiration and new ideas. You probably have a favorite workspace, but also venture out to coffee shops or co-working spaces. The absence of plugs at your favorite coffee shop can sometimes be frustrating, but with a good battery life you can take your laptop wherever you go and get the work done, all while enjoying the digital nomad freedom. What is the best laptop for graphic design? Graphic designers tend to have a specific list of requirements for laptops, but rarely can you tick all of the boxes on the list. More likely, you'll spend hours researching all the different options and trying to find the best price features combination. The Apple MacBook Pro remains the number one preferred option for many designers due to its stunning design and top performance. But other brands are also catching up with high performance offers that are no less pleasing to the eye. Let us know in the comments down below which laptop you're going to choose. Thanks for watching and that is all for this video. If you like this video and it helped you in any way, please get this video a like and if you don't want to miss out on any future videos, subscribe to the channel. Hope to see you in the next video, till next time, see you guys later.